Hey guys, I just wanted to share this quick word that the Lord had given me um, in the middle of the night. He woke me up and he was talking about a lot of different things, but um, this is what I want to share with you guys. I saw George Bush and I heard the Lord say veterans and I seen a veteran in like the army fatigue and I heard the Lord say payback. It's payback time. My veterans will be recompensed for my glory. They did not go in vain. They will do what I call them to do. And I heard the Lord say numbers. Then I heard the Lord say many by the count, the sheep to the slaughter, herds, ammunition. Then I heard the Lord say holy attire. I heard the Lord say wake and bake, not needed anymore. Abuse, abuse of the minds, mindset. My veterans will be replenished. My veterans' voices will be heard. Veterans' pride will go. They will have pride in me for my glory. Detailed events happening up ahead. Segue. Denominational, carefree, gauntlet, recompense, cedar woods, just nations, and guys, this is just me intervening. Sometimes the Lord just gives me words and then he puts it together later. Going back to the word, torment no more. It will leave their bodies. It will leave their cells. Healing will take place. Refuge will come. Patriots will endure. So Father God, I just want to say a prayer for all the veterans out there. No matter where you went, no matter um, if you were deployed for 9-11 and you had to go to Iraq or Afghanistan or anything else, or I just want to uh, pray for you right now. Father God, I plead the blood of Jesus over everyone who has seen battle, who has been in war, who has been traumatized, who has any type of post-traumatic distress order, Father God, and any symptom of it. Uh, Father God, I plead the blood of Jesus over them from the top of their head to the soles of their feet, every layer of their soul and their atmosphere. Father God, I stand in the gap and I intercede for them. Father God, I repent for all their sins known and unknown. Hmm. I hear the Lord saying, I make a way when you thought there was no way. And then I heard the Lord say, journalism, write down your experiences Oof. and share my loved ones. For I am giving you recompense in this hour. And I see judgment is here. Be on the right side and forgive all, says the Lord. Do me gloomy days no more. Say, Alma, this is the year. Sequel stories will be heard, says the Lord. My glory will shine on your faces. See how I'm at there, my veterans, my love for you. I hold great, near, dear to my heart, says the Lord. Any pain you can escape with me. Maria Rama, see I trusted allies, friends. Before he said that, he said, Dorothy will tell you, I'm at there. So the mysteries from above, the secrets of heaven. I will pour down a blessing until I cannot pour down anymore. You will be overflowing, says the Lord. I will use you to speak for my glory. You will tell tales of your experiences, says the Lord. An awakening is happening. An arrival is coming to my people, the chosen ones. For my army will rise up. I will assist you in my glory, says the Lord. Yeah, you will make trusted allies in me, says the Lord. I hear the complaints running deep in your heart. Memories that have been made. Wartime battles. I will rescue you out of them all, says the Lord. The glory is within me. 
It is within you when you choose me, when you choose life and not death. Do not wonder about the vain things. Wonder about me, God, and I will give you and I will give you answers when disaster and calamity strikes. Hear the word hindsight. Look towards me, says the Lord. These things are true, says the Lord. See you will know who I am. Revival is in town. Seek me harder in these last days. Hallelujah. So, Father God, I just <clears throat> stand in the gap and intercede for them. And any veteran who has not accepted Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior, it is not a coincidence that you're listening to me right now. The Lord has chosen you for such a time as this, for this time and in in this day. And you have fought the good fight uh, in the physical realm. Now it's time to be a spiritual sniper for Jesus. That is your true calling. Hallelujah. To be a part of God's army. And the only way to the Father, Yahweh, is the Son, Jesus Christ. And heaven and hell is real. There's no in-between. There's no, uh, what do you call it, purgatory. No, when you die, it says to be absent from the body is to be present with the Lord. You're either present with the Lord or you're in hell. So if you don't accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, then you will go to hell. That's the only way to enter in. And straight and narrow is the way to life. Wide and destruction is the way wide and destruction is the way to death and many people take it but few people take the narrow path and the lord sees you and you're on his heart so if you haven't given your life to jesus christ and you want to and you want to pick up your cross and die daily and obey him and let him be the lord and savior of your life meaning follow his commands read his word get in his word and see what he wants you to do say this prayer with me jesus i confess you are god and I ask that you come into my life. I accept you as my personal Lord and Savior. I agree to, to pick up my cross and die daily. I confess all of my sins. All of my sins. And I want you to go through your sins and just say every sin that you confess, any addiction. We're saying addiction to pornography, addiction to drugs, addiction to alcohol, any unforgiveness. Uh, any um, lying, any deception that was believed, just go down the lines uh, and ask the Holy Spirit to help you to confess and just say, I confess all of my sins, known and unknown, and I ask for forgiveness, Jesus. And Holy Spirit, I ask that you come inside of me, hallelujah, and give me grace, super abundant grace, and show me the way how to follow Jesus. If you said that prayer right now, hallelujah, welcome to the kingdom of heaven. Please email me so that I can baptize you and do deliverance on you and help you and assist you in your walk with the Lord. And guys, please hit that like button. If you watch me and haven't subscribed, please subscribe and please share this video as many people as possible, as many veterans that you uh, know, as many people that need help. Until next time, stay blessed.